normal distribution. In today's video, the problem here is if x is normally distributed with mean 2 and variance 0 0.5, then find probability of modulus of x minus 2 greater than or equal to 0 0.01. See here, the mean is given as 2 and the variance is given as 0 0.1. And now we have to find out the probability of modulus of uh, x minus 2 greater than or equal to 0 0.01. See here, mean value, the mean mu is given as 2 and the standard deviation sigma is given as 0 0.1. And see, we have to find out this one, modulus of x minus 2, if I take equal to 0 0.01. See here, so if I take this modulus, see what happens, plus or minus 0 0.01. So one time I'll take a positive value and the next time I'll take the negative value. See here the x value is nothing but 2 plus 0 0.01 and see here x is equal to 2 minus 0 0.01. See here 2 plus 0 0.01 is nothing but 2.01 whereas 2 minus 0 0.01 is nothing but 1.99. So we got the two values if we take the modulus. When x is, e x is equal to 2.01 and x is equal to 1.99. See, when x is equal to, when x is equal to 1.99, so what will be the z value? So, z is equal to x minus mu by sigma. So, what is our x value here? 1.99. So, this is 1.99 minus mu. So, what is our mu value? So, mu is given as 2. So, this is 2 divided by sigma value is given as 0 0.1. So, this is 0 0.1 and see our z value will be 1.99 minus 2 divided by 0 0.1. The value here is this is minus 0 0.1. So, we got the value of uh, z as minus 0 0.1 and see Next, if we keep x is equal to 2.01, see, keep x is equal to 2.01, then see what will be the z value. Again, the z value is equal to, this is x minus mu by sigma. So, what is our x value? x value is nothing but 2.01 minus 2 by 0 0.1. So, this is nothing but 2.01 minus 2 divided by 0 0.1 is nothing but plus 0 0.1. So, we got the value of z as, see here, we got the value of z as 0 0.1. Now, see probability of, see here, now if I calculate modulus of x minus 2 less than 0 0.01, so it will be in terms of z, see, so this can be written as 1.99 less than x less than 2.01. So x lies between these two points. So in terms of z if I write then this will be. So for 1.99 see our z for 1.99 the z value is minus 0 0.1. So this will be minus 0 0.1 less than z for uh, 2.01 the value of z is 0 plus 0 0.1 and see. Now we have to find out this value. See, see now the diagram here will be the normal variate here will be see this tends to plus infinity and this tends to minus infinity as usual. So x is equal to mu. See for negative value for x is equal to see x is equal to 1.99. And see the next one, this is x is equal to 2.01. In terms of z, if I write, see, z is equal to 0. So, this is z is equal to 0 0.1 and this value is uh, minus 0 0.5. Negative sign will be towards the left side of the ordinate. See, now we need this area. So, the area in between these two. See here. So, this is the required area. And now, see, now we are going to calculate probability of, I'll show you the probability of modulus of x minus 2 less than 0 
which is equal to that is probability of uh, minus 0 0.1 less than z less than 0 0.1. So instead of calculating from negative to 0 and 0 to 0 0.1, so I am writing this as or else area between z is equal to 0 to z is equal to see here minus 0 0.1 to 0 plus the area between z is equal to 0 to 0 0.1 so by symmetry we can write as z the area between 0 to 0 0.1 plus the area between 0 to 0 0.1 so this distance and this distance is equal see 0 to minus 0 0.1 equals to z is equal to 0 to z is equal to 0 0.1 so this can be written as two times of the area between 0 to this is 0 0.1 that is two times of 0 0.1 under 0 0 0.1 under 0 is 0 0.0398 0 0.0398 so if we multiply this will be 0 0.0796 see here this is nothing but probability of modulus of x minus 2 less than 0 0.01 now we need the greater than value instead of calculating the greater than value that is probability of modulus of x minus 2 greater than or equal to 0 0.01 so here is the formula that is 1 minus probability of modulus of x minus 2 less than 0 0.01 value. So this will be 1 minus 0 0.0796. So if we subtract see here this will be 0 0.9204 is the answer. So this is so simple to follow see here if we have modulus see. If we take the modulus, it will be plus or minus 0 0.01. If we take plus positive for one time and negative for one time, these are the x values. If we keep x is equal to 1.99, z value will be minus 0 0.1. If we keep x is equal to 0, 2.01, the x value is plus 0 0.1. So, first of all, modulus of x minus 2 less than 0 0.01. 0, 1 is nothing but in between these two. So, in terms of z, so this is the value and this is the normal graph or curve and see here after calculating the less than value so we have to calculate the greater than or equal to so we can subtract from 1 as the total probability is always equal to unity so this is the value that is 0 0.9204 thank you so much for watching if you really like please practice and pass it on to your friends